Hello, it's Patrick here from Fallon Photography and this is just a brief video explaining how to view and download your images from the Fallon Photography client gallery area. So if you are watching this video then you have probably received an email from me with a uh, link and some passwords for your client gallery. So you will have received uh, a link to the gallery itself, a login password and a download all pin. Um, and I'm going to explain to you guys how to use those to uh, view and download your images. So if you click on the link to the client gallery in that email, that will open a browser window uh, with the sort of the entry page to your client gallery. Um, I have just, I've created a sample gallery, uh, well it's a real gallery, and I have copied the, the link to it and just pasted it in here in this browser window. And don't worry about the fact that this browser window looks weird and it says you've gone incognito. Uh, this is Google Chrome. I'm just using incognito mode so that I can view the client gallery as a visitor would. So like I said, you just click on the link in the email and that will open the entry page to the gallery. Um, I've copied and pasted the link into this browser. Just hit enter and that will take us to our login page. Uh, now, I've just recorded the password here, so you'll have also received a password by email. And to enter that, just click on the enter password button, or it looks like a button, and then um, your cursor will appear, and then you can just copy and paste your password in there. And then you can either hit enter or you can click on login, and that will take you to the client gallery area, as soon as my computer does its thing. Okay, so it'll show you an entry page like this with one image uh, and a description of the gallery, and you can just scroll down and see the rest of your images. It may take a little while for them all to appear um, in your browser, depending on your internet speed. Um, but yeah, this is just a small gallery, so that's all of them there. Now, you can view all of the images uh, up, up close and personal. Uh, just by clicking on them. So let's click on this one and we'll open it. And you can see uh, at the top, you can favorite it, you can download it, and you can hit play to play a slideshow. Now, um, with the buy button, it's a bit misleading. I give my clients their images you know, included in the packages, so they're free. So you can still click buy if you, if you want the photo, but you don't need to. You just click download, and that will download the individual photo. But the other option, which I would recommend using, if you scroll right to the top, you see there's some icons up here. Uh, play slideshow. This is the download button. Uh, download all button, I should say. This is a shopping cart to show you what's in your shopping cart if you've ordered something. Uh, and this is the number of favorites you have. So I would recommend as soon as you get your client, get access to your client gallery, download them all in high resolution, and then I'd recommend downloading them all in low resolution as well, so that you have copies of both. The low resolution, obviously, for social media, email, and quick previewing, and the high resolution for printing. So I'm gonna go ahead and click this download all arrow and I am going to need the download all pin so I'm just going to copy that from here okay so select your country New Zealand that's me and download all into the pin validate pin just click on that validate pin button now um, what you it may also ask you to log in um, it hasn't done this time for me, but if it does, if you scroll right to the bottom of the login window, there'll be a login as guest option. Just use that. Um, okay, so we've got three options here. The only two options I recommend using, download the images in full size. Okay, so do that first, so you've got a high resolution copy of everything. Um, so you have a copy of all the data. So just click add to cart. Oh, here we go, here's a login window. So if you go to the bottom, you'll see here, click here to guest checkout. So we'll click there. And now it'll take us back to the download all window. And you'll see here it says view cart, it says one. That's because we have one copy of all the high res images in our cart, which is awesome. And then I recommend downloading the social media size. So just click on that option and click add to cart. And now we've got two items in our cart. 
and then simply go to the view cart area by clicking on the view cart button. Just confirm that you've got the full size, yes, one of those. You've got the social media size, yes, one of those. Uh, next, enter your details. Now this is a bit of a pain in the neck. Um, I don't know why it needs all this information, but I can't help it, I'm afraid. And this is obviously my computer, um, so I've got autofill settings. So I just use those and it will allow me to, it'll fill in most of the data for me. I'm just going to change that to the correct email address. Phone number 021-737-156. And let me see, everything else is correct. State Otago, special instructions. You can obviously put them in there if you want. Confirm and place order. And place order again. Payment completed, thank you. Um, so as you see, it was free. You didn't have to enter any credit card details. And you should very shortly after doing this receive an email from Queensbury, which is the company I use for my client gallery, uh, with a uh, copy of your images. All right. Thank you team, hopefully that all makes sense and uh, yeah, if you have any issues with, the, uh, with viewing or downloading your images, just let me know, get in touch. Okay, see ya. Gotta be shitting me.